What's up, you guys? It is Brinley, Lindsay, and Jensen here. I don't know how to say my own name. <laughs> nope, it's Jensen. Try after me, Jensen. Jensen! Why don't you introduce everybody? Oh, wow, I'm Jensen. <laughs> and who am I? You're Lindsay. <laughs> who am I? Brinley. <laughs> We're dumb. I didn't mean for it to be mean. It wasn't mean. Okay. Ah. Ah. Anyways, it's us. Riley's not here. She's a dance or something. And she is just doing her own thing all the time, but, um, yeah, so basically. We are getting very freaking close to baby girl coming to visit us Earthside here Earthside. Earthside and honestly, I am feeling it. If you can't tell I look like a piece of poop right well, now I think you need to stop flipping <coughs> your hair My hair hasn't been washed in days. I'm not wearing makeup. She told us today She said my biggest thing is I'm so stressed if my hair is not washed and I go into labor I know but or I still haven't washed clean. it or my house isn't clean. My house is a mess it's just a lot. I'm trying to nest, but it's coming up quick. And I actually have kind of, so things are actually moving a little bit faster than I thought. Um, at my last doctor's appointment, I was already dilated to a two and a half, which we were both shocked by because baby girl is still breached. So that means her head is up here in my rib cage and her feet are down by my cervix. That is not the position she is supposed to be in. And it's probably, it's very unlikely that she's going to flip at this point. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're kind of just planning on that. But anyways, my doctor was super shocked that I was even dilated at all because there's no head pushing down. So things no, are moving fast. Weird. Yeah. I didn't even think about that. Yeah. So it's, things are moving fast. And we also, as of now, are kind of planning that I'm going to have to have a C-section, which isn't really what I was planning in the beginning. But honestly, at this point, I just want... I just want to have her and I don't care how I need to do it. I just want her to be healthy and I want her to be here. So that's kind of the plan. And because of that, I'm actually going to be having that scheduled a week earlier than my due date. So that's like a week away. Week and a half away. That's actually insane. I know. It's freaking crazy. I can't believe it. I feel like I have everything done, but then I also like every single day think of these like little things that, that we need to need. do. Yeah. But... Like, the final thing that everybody has been telling me to be prepared with is my hospital bag. Because literally, like, I mean, I'm having contractions at night. I'm, I feel things are happening and moving. So really, I could go into labor and I definitely want to be prepared for that. Yeah. So I thought it'd be fun. We thought it'd be fun. We thought it'd be fun to pack our hospital bag with the girls they're gonna have a lot of insight and they can help me pick out what outfit I wanna bring. Baby home. So cute. Oh. Cause she has a lot of outfits to choose from. Yeah, she does. And I kinda wanna wearing all of them. Just every 30 minutes. <laughs> every, seriously, that might be her life. She won't even well, know. Well, you might actually have that. Cause I feel like babies, they either spit up. Do they spit up when they're that little? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. So you're gonna need, and they diarrhea, and, and they have a yellow Their poop. poops are, no, their poops are black at first. Oh, oh yeah, the baby know. quiz, baby quiz. Anyways, we're gonna do that today. So I need your help, girls, because I'm also, my brain doesn't work very well, and I don't make decisions <laughs> properly <laughs> at the moment. So. Well, we will be your logic. Okay. I'll be the logic, Brindley will be the fun. Hmm. Oh. Maybe the other way. <laughs> well, Brenda will be in the logic and Jensen will be in the fun. <laughs> Did you do a rewind sound? Yeah. <laughs> Was that a good one? No. Oh. You're such a okay, I got the picture. Okay. <laughs> okay, you guys. So we are going to start with my toiletries bag, which to me is like the most important totally. thing. Totally. And it's also the hardest thing. That's why I need these yeah. girls' help. So, as you can see, we have a lot of our favorite products laid out. Mm -hmm. All of these products are from Tula, which is a doctor-founded, clean and effective skincare and wellness brand. 
All of the products are formulated with probiotics and superfood. Probiotics are a powerful natural ingredient that helps restore the natural balance of your skin's microbiome, soothe and nourish your skin, and boost its appearance. Which, which is good. yummy. Very good. We Very want good. that on our we face. We want the yummy, yummy on our face. Yes, we do. And they also have this cutest bag that they set the products in so I can pack everything in there. And it's nice because then you can see what you're grabbing. Yeah. But here's my dilemma. So it's like, I'm going to be in the hospital with a newborn. So I know I might not have like my full, my normal amount of time for my skincare routine. Yeah. So I feel like we need to narrow it down to like four products. Four? Oh, that's going to be so hard. I think you need eye patches. Okay. Totally. So you can even put them on while you're giving birth because why not? Yeah. Oh, that'd be you fun. That's I mean? a really good idea. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Brat! <laughs> Okay, but these are the I feel amazing eye patches. Ooh, okay, so I do. They're made of probiotic superfoods, like we just said, but they're brightening and hydrating. And you're gonna Let need that. So maybe let's give you three. Oh yeah, they have hyaluronic acid in them, quinoa oh. seed, and green coffee caffeine. Coffee caffeine. I'm gonna need that. You're gonna okay, be feeling put three in there. Yeah, and those are so tiny. We can just squeeze them in. It's yeah. Fine. It's okay. Fine. That doesn't count. We're still gonna do four more products after that. Okay. okay. So one of my favorites is the beauty sleep treatment. Okay. So it's like a moisturizer. It's really good. It's very good. Like I put it on my skin last night and it's awesome. But I just feel like you're gonna need a lot of moisture. Oh in yeah. Your skin. My skin is super dry. I have two faves that I feel like, cause here's the thing, I want to do my skincare routine so like my skin stays nice, but yeah. I also want to like maybe make myself feel like a little bit cute and not just like tired and gross. So True. these are like what I've been using to replace makeup these days. Mm. The face filter blurring and priming moisturizer. I use that as my foundation most days now because it just gives like a little tint to the skin and evens out your skin tone. And then also this rose glow and get it cooling and brightening eyeball. But these are definitely going in. Yeah. Okay, you guys, I got my toiletries packed, all my favorite Tula products, and I am so excited. We want you guys to try this stuff out because we freaking love it. So, gents, so what do they got to do? All you need to do now is go to Tula.com, and you can use code Arnold Sisters for 15% off your Tula order. Yay! Okay, now that we got the toiletries done, let's move on to some clothes and baby items. And Oh, I'm so excited. Ooh, yeah! Okay, girl. Okay. Got my little suitcase. So, here's the thing. I'm preparing, I'm packing a bag as if, as if I'm having a C-section. If something okay. changes, obviously I probably won't need this much stuff, but <clears throat> I'll be in the hospital, what, for like three days at least? Mm -hmm. Like at least. At least three. Yeah. Okay, so. Wait, so if you have her vaginally, is that? It's quicker. It's probably quicker. like, isn't it like 20 hours? hours? Yeah. <clears throat> really? Yeah. yeah. So I'm just going to prepare for the longer stay just so I'm ready. Yep. But yeah, maybe it won't be. Long stay. Oh. Anyways, okay, let's start with my stuff because it's not as fun. Then we'll get to baby yeah. girl at the end. I think first fun. things first, we have to have your comfy clothes. Yes. So these, so I, so I also did some research. If you have a C-section, you don't really want stuff with like low Tight. seams because the scar will be it's down there. So you either want like high-waisted stuff. So I got this really cute set, which this tank is perfect for nursing. Oh yeah. Because I can just, just like pull it, out. pull it out, pull the boob out. And so this is pants. Yeah, it's like a little three-piece set, high-waisted like That's lounge comfy. pants, and a little um, robe like a little thing. Kimono. Cute. Yeah, a little kimono. So I think that will be really comfy. Yeah. Yes. I think that's a good option. Are those right? high-waisted? Yes, those are high-waisted. Okay. Yeah. So that's. Good. And then it has a little tie too. Yeah, for the robe. So even if I just wanted to wear like the robe for a little bit, yeah. which I honestly might want to do. Oh, totally. Um. So yeah, I packed that. Tie then up. yeah. I guess let's put that. Which in. side do you want to put it on this side? Okay. I'm trying to stuff all my clothes in there. Okay, then I have this jumper, which is awesome because yeah. there's no, there's no like waistband. It's just loose and cozy. cozy. Yes. So I feel like that will be really very nice. nice. And it's also like open up here so I can breastfeed easy. So that's another cozy outfit. I brought, I just got one of these like. Oh, mm, yes. Classic. One of these classic little oh my button gosh. down robe. Okay, wait, what brand is this one? This is. Stars above. From Target? Yes. It is, this is really like comfy. The best. So comfortable. I know, I went to Target the other day to buy more, but they didn't have any in my size, so. Yeah. Just have to do with one. But this I think is gonna be, honestly, I won't be surprised if much. I just wear this the whole time. <clears throat> totally. I'm fine with wearing the same that's outfit. That's like a one piece, already has the buttons. Yeah. I it'll be awesome. Okay, so I got my three outfits, and then I got one more because, Duh. you know. These are just some really cozy pajama pants. Oh, yes. And another little button down. Cute. So that'll be good too. Yeah. And I thought I'd do pink, you know, just so I can be like 
Girl, girl, girl mom. Girl mom. Um, okay. So that's kind of, oh, also, oh, yes, so yes, yes. I have this robe that is such a cute little fabric. Just like, it's just a pretty, cute, comfy robe. That but matches. I have a matching swaddle and headband for baby girls. So I'm like, Aww. I feel like even, but it's just a swaddle. So like, yeah. she'll still need an outfit underneath, but I just thought for a picture it'd be so very cute. cute. So Look at yeah. this. I'm and that's really comfy. I know, it's like a really soft, nice, silky material, silky, yeah. which I think is key. Key! Okay, so then I was thinking, well, I brought slippers. Duh. Because, come on, you need slippers. And they have sticky bottoms. And then I also brought fuzzy, fuzzy socks. socks. <laughs> That's good I stuff. just think you'll need them, you know? Oh, yeah. Keep you warm. Once the hospital gave you aren't comfy, but they're warm. So, I think this is good. They aren't comfy? I mean, they're, they're whatever. Are they the ones that have, like, the tracking on the bottom? Like, yeah. The... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Some of those have, um... Little jelly stoppers. things, yeah, so that I can run down the hall. <laughs> yeah, I, mean, like, I don't think you're gonna be running. No, I am not going to be Maybe. Running. Maybe. Absolutely. So there's my outfits. What do you think? Do we, do I we have enough? You're... I mean, I think I probably have more than enough, but I'd rather yeah. be prepared. Yeah, and we not. can always bring our you more camp. stuff. We can oh. give stuff to Sam. That's I true, yeah. We and can pick out your outfits from home. That's sad. Yeah. Yeah. But I feel like this is I feel like this is good. No, I think I don't think I honestly don't even think I'll wear all of that. At least I'll have the option. And then okay. Not really clothes, but I do want to include these two hair things because. Oh yeah. So apparently, everybody says you really want to shower after. Oh, yeah. You, you can eat. shower. Yeah, you can. You can give the baby a and turn the yeah. nursery. They'll help you shower. Really? Yeah. yeah. So I. Could even wash your hair for you if if they can't do like a bed bath where you just. Could like, you wash your hair with your scarf? Like, are you yeah. able to lift your arms? I mean, you're supposed to be moving. Sam can do it. It's not. Uh, it's not that hard. Yeah, he can. <laughs> Okay. Anyways, I'm bringing my Purology it, shampoo and conditioner because yeah. if I'm washing my hair, I want it to be like, good. I want it yes. to feel good. Okay. So, so I'm bringing that, okay. and then dry shampoo. for the for the maybe possible chance I show up and my hair is really dirty, I got my Moroccan oil dry shampoo, so I don't yep. have to worry about it. Good. Okay, now on to the fun part. Yeah, I know that was like kind of boring and lame, but now we do the fun stuff. Okay. So hey. Lindsay. So you I kind of narrowed down. Picked. I narrowed down a couple outfits that I think would be Look. perfect for baby. So, okay, the first one we already showed you, it's this cute swaddle that matches my robe, and then this little headband. What do you think? I, I mean, I think I should just bring it because- Well, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Why not, you 100%. know? 100%. I could even just swaddle her in this over one of these outfits. Do you have like a little onesie to put her in? Um, yeah. Oh, oh, we're getting right to it. <laughs> That is Look seriously how cute so little cute. Little tiny ones he is. And then I thought this hat would be so cute with it. Oh yes, neutral. This oh little gosh. beanie. I can't believe. I know. So I really like that one. Yeah, yes. mm -hmm. That looks cozy. She needs cozy. Outfits. I know. Okay, so I like that. She needs to be warm. This is probably one of my faves, and I feel like it's perfect because if she's a big baby or a small baby, it'll, it'll fit, fit either, either way. way yeah. So this is just like a little knotted gown. So. Yeah, so you just tie it at the bottom, which is really awesome, I've heard, for like diaper changes. Yeah, it makes it easier. Because you just like open it up. And... How cute is this fabric? It is so cute. And so that's that's what you'd think she'd wear going home? Yeah, Maybe? Because so. that would match your outfit going home. Oh, yeah. Like, look at the vibe. Oh yeah, Good vibe. <laughs> yeah, I kind of think this will be her going home outfit. Or, so or though, this one's also really cute. So it's like this. Little I want her oh. in this. Oh wait, yes, I forgot the most important part. The bow with this. The bow. Oh yes, the bow. The little headband. Yes. Very. Cute. That's an essential. Okay. But I want her in this when she comes home. I know. That's so cute too. So cute. It's a baby little buddy. It's hard to decide, but this is like the cutest little, but it's newborn and it's so, so, so tiny. So she ends up being a little bit bigger. This might be too small on her, but look at that little shirt. What's crazy to me is that like a, a creep, a creature, <laughs> a, a creature person that fits in this outfit is inside of my belly right I now. I know. And it's just, she's, she's just, just like curled. curled, but like that will fit her. Yep. Oh my God, I'm so excited. <laughs> so, okay. I mean. You got That's a lot. Out close. <laughs> I know. Her. What do we think though? Because do I need all of them? Probably. Yeah. Yes. Look how tiny oh. that is. Yeah, Compared that's to true. yours. Compared to yours. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> She's a lot easier that's to That's literally about. like this. This thing. hat is so cute. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, yeah, then I'm just going to bring it all. Yeah. 
Okay, so I think we're good to go. We I are. Mean, I still gotta add in like my electronics. I need a long phone charger. Yep. I need probably a portable charger too, just to have. Totally. I've been told to bring, well, I'll bring my laptop so maybe I can like do some things, watch Netflix or something. Yeah. And I'm trying to think of any other Give like. Your toothbrush? Oh yeah, I got my toothbrush, deodorant, tweezers, eyelash curler. <laughs> Those um, are what all. What about Sam's like head lamp for the GoPro? <laughs> <laughs> to film the birth. To film the birth. Yeah, we were thinking, you know, it'd be really cool for Sam to wear a GoPro. Anything on his head. Sam views, you view. Yes. But, yeah, that's the one thing. That is, so Sam is going to be the only one in the room at my birth, um, and these girls can't come Except me in the hospital. I work at the hospital that she's giving birth at, so maybe I'll get on. Maybe I will. Maybe she'll sneak in. Maybe. But, and, yeah, I can't have, my mom can be my one visitor, so my mom will be able to come in the hospital room, but these girls will all That's why I want all the details. I know. All the camera angles. All the things. Well, I'll get them for you. But it is, I mean, I would have normally had a videographer come and film the birth so we could, like, capture that, but that's not going to be possible. So we're probably just going to be doing, like, make your own video. Yeah, just I'll do probably a just tripod, blog. Tripod, blog. Tripod, yeah. Just I'll have Sam film, but... Yeah. I want to see Sam film. Sam won't film. And I actually don't really want Sam to film. I want him no, just to enjoy no, it. No. So probably, honestly, I'll be setting up a camera on a tripod and that'll be that. Yeah. But, yeah. Oh. Okay, well, I feel very ready and, I mean, kind of. You have to wash your hair first. Yeah, I gotta wash my hair. <laughs> gotta clean the house first. But now I'm like, do I need to wash my hair every day? Because, like, if I wash my hair one day and that doesn't happen, then I don't worry about it too much. It's okay. My it's fine. Clean. <laughs> <laughs> you can wear a headband. Ooh. Yeah, it's cool. Baby one on. I'll just wear this. Yeah, I think that. Oh, <laughs> I don't want to touch you. You look like um, Yoda. Yes, oh, you oh, did. I did. <laughs> okay, you guys. Thanks for watching. Yes. Hope you enjoyed so me fun. packing my suitcase. That was, oh, you know, this was fun for us. Riveting stuff. But seriously, I've. I'm it's glad a part of the process. It is, and it's kind of like the last thing. Yeah, like, it's important. Yeah. Okay. Well. <gasps> Hopefully oh. next time we do this video, we'll have a baby. We'll have a baby. <laughs> but you guys are the best. Thank you so much for watching. Um, yeah, if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. Also in the description, we'll put our Tula um, link and code so you guys can check that out. Um, other than that, thanks for watching. Bye, you guys.